Hi everybody, it's Lisa, Twyla's mom, and today is Friday, so you know what that means. We go to the Dollar Tree right after work. Yeah, so I thought I would get on here and show you real quick what we found. Now, I'm not on camera because I haven't, uh, I just woke up and yeah. <laughs> ah, so I just thought I'd, you know, go ahead and do this, so. Let's go ahead and get started, okay? So the first thing I have here is some of the SureFresh Slider Seal Storage Bags. They're the quart size. You get 14 in here. This isn't the best deal, but I needed some sandwich bags, and uh, so I just picked this one up because, yeah, just because I want to give them a try. If they're good, they're good. Yeah, so pick that up. Now, this is not going to be in any kind of order, either. Okay, now, they also still had some of the wreath hangers. Uh, last week, I picked up a brown one, so this week, I picked up an orange one. So, that's going to come in handy. Get a sip of my coffee, because like I said, I just woke up. Oh, that tastes so good. So, so good. Needed some more razors, so I went and picked up the package of these five-blade razors. Um, yeah, I tried them. They're pretty good. They didn't have any more of my favorite ones, so but they had plenty of these, and they're okay. But you get three of these, so pick them up. Okay. Our toilet paper is needing to be replenished again, so I picked up two packages of the bath tissue. I like it. Um, a lot of people don't like it, but I like it. I think it's a, it's good. Yeah. <laughs> I have no clue why, but I really, really wanted some Captain Crunch when I saw this, so I picked it up. Now, this is a tiny, tiny little box. It's only 5.5 .5 ounces. Uh, how many servings is in this? It says only about six, but um, an adult, that's three-fourths of a cup. So you know that we're not going to eat just three-fourths of a cup. So this box went from six servings to maybe two and a half servings. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so yeah, pick that up. I just had to have some Captain Crunch. <laughs> Then I saw these, and these are new in my store, and I don't think I've seen anyone else haul them. I'm not sure, but they are the facial scrubbers, and um, they are these silicone type ones. They have like little nubbies on them, and you can feel it. They have a little hole here to kind of feel them, and then they also have that little thing that extends out that you can you know, hold with your fingers. So I thought, you know what, I'm going to try these and see how they work. And if they work, because, you know, it's a Dollar Tree brand, and they had a lot of them. If they work, and I like how they feel on my face, then maybe I'll pick up a few for other people. So pick that up. Oh, boy. Uh, now, I'm trying to get different uh, soup and cereal bowls for us and uh, get rid of my small ones that, you know, <clears throat> they came with my dishes and stuff and they've served their, their purpose quite well. But now that small children are out of my house and everything, I'm going to let the smaller, you know, bowls go on to a new home while I pick up a few other bowls. So I found this set and it's uh oh it's not really a teal it's coming across teal but it's more of a blue green and it's the nice deep one but I loved this design on here. Isn't that pretty? I like that a lot. So I picked up two of them Uh, let's see. Then I found in the teacher section 
the over the chair storage. I don't know, can you see that? I'm going to use this here in my craft room. It doesn't look real, real sturdy, but it might hang on to, you know, like a notebook that I'm writing in, a journal, something like that. But I'm going to put it on the chair in my craft room. Uh, let's see. I got some books. <clears throat> this one is called Slade House. And it's kind of a mystery type book. It's really interesting. It's got this cut out because this is, I guess, like the map of the house. Um, but here is the back if you would like to pause it, zoom in, and read about it. Not sure how much it was because they've got it covered. Does it say in the front cover? No, it does not. But it's a random house and it is a hardcover book. I've really got to start reading because I've got quite the collection of books and I never seem to read. But I love them. And then here is this one, Her Abundant Joy. And here is the back if you'd like to read about it. This is period piece fiction. Um, and I really do like the older ones of that age. Uh, this one is The House of Hawthorne. And here is this one. And let's see, this one, does it say on the front cover, uh, mm, oh, well, this one back here was $16, and then uh, they covered this one up too, so, but they looked very interesting, wanted to, you know, put those into my collection, because one day I will have time to read, I promise. <laughs> Then I get a package of Nutter Butter Bites. Um, these were just an impulse buy up by the register. Um, I'm trying to be a little bit better about work um, this whole week. I did not take a bunch of snacks. I made myself a sandwich. I took a small bag of chips and took one snack to work. And each break, I would you know, like have a little snack or I'd eat half my sandwich or a few of my chips. I'm really trying to get off that snack habit at work. So I picked up these. I figured I could half it, you know, and take a few to work one day and a few the next day. And yeah, so I'm trying to get off of that snack habit. I am because you guys know I love my snacks. Then I found this new face um, Dove Go Fresh Cool Moisture. Uh, they usually just carry the regular Dove at my store. I, and let's see, it is in the cucumber and green tree scent. I'm not a big fan of cucumber smell. I don't like cucumbers. I don't like the smell. I'm hoping that the green tree uh, is a stronger smell than the cucumber but I doubt it <laughs> but um, I had to try it and I I use Dove on my face to clean my face every day and I really really like Dove for my face the bar soap so there we go oh my goodness I've been there down then I did find the metal letters for the Thanksgiving decorations and it is thankful harvest and welcome so I picked up one package of those and they're metal so I wish they came in a different color like why are they in silver they should be in brown you know I might get some spray paint and spray paint these because you know brown or orange or even a brick red, I think, would be better than silver for, you know, Thanksgiving. So I might give it a try. Or, you know, who knows. <laughs> then I was happy to find these. And I'm going to put these away for Twyla. And they are the canvas 
panels. She's always doing, you know, her artwork and everything like that. And these are an 8x10 size. And they are thin enough they would fit in an 8x10 frame. I'm not sure that they'd fit with the glass in the frame, but we'll give it a try. And I thought she would really like these because she'll do a port, you know, a picture or something. She'll paint or draw something and then give that away for Christmas or birthdays. You know, like to her grandparents or her brothers. Then I found this small one in the 4x6. But this one actually has the frame. So I thought that was pretty neat. And then the two panels in the 5x7. So you get two, pa two of these in the package. And then this one in the 6x8. Now this one is the canvas around the frame. So I thought she would like these and um, yeah, I'm just going to put these away. If they have more next weekend, I'll get her another set. And um, yeah, because a canvas just to, you know, practice and doodle with, you know, a dollar, you can't beat that. They're not real expensive to begin with, you know, like 8 by 10s and stuff. Um, they can be. You know, the higher quality and the bigger in size, they can be expensive, but um, yeah, they you can get them on sale at Michael's and stuff like that. So they, they don't have to be extremely expensive, but they can be. Okay, now, I did find, I saw Leanna on It's a Deal. She showed these, and I had to get them, and I was so happy that my Dollar Tree had them. A few months back, I had picked my grandsons up those Lego sets that they have, you know, the panels, and then all the different colored Legos to go with it, and the different colored panels and stuff. And Leanna showed these, and these are favor boxes, but they are in the Lego the Lego sets. And I thought, how cool is that? Those would be perfect for holding the little Lego people. So I picked up one, I picked up three packages, one for each one of my grandsons. Now my youngest grandson's too young for the tiny little Legos. He, he does well with Duplos and stuff, but the small little Legos, he, he's still a little small. Um, it, not that he would put him in his mouth because he's four but his little fingers you know manipulating all those little tiny legos i think he could probably do well with not the baby duplos but the junior ones at any rate i only got three for the three older ones so. but i thought that would be so cool to store their little people in so i got four and i bet this would hold like three or four different people so I picked up three of those. Then, speaking of the Lego people, I saw these and it's like, oh my gosh, I've got to get them. I have got to get them for my boys. Yes. Now, they did have a girl set of these. But my boys, my um, grandsons, they are very um, boy they they really really are where's the other one i thought i picked up i did oh my gosh that makes me mad i picked up oh here it is okay the i could okay lisa get it together i was about ready to get mad <laughs> But anyway, I was so excited to find these because these will go with the Lego sets because they are top blocks that I bought for all three of the boys. And they are the little people. Yes! See this one? This one is the fireman and construction worker. So I picked up a box of each one of these. Then I picked them up the military and policemen. So they each get a box of those. 
And then I also picked up the Space and the Ninja guys. So they each get a box of these. And um, they're going to go great with those little um, panels and the Legos that I got them. Well, they're not Legos. They are top blocks. And if I remember reading correctly, I thought I had read that they would go with most name brand things, you know, like um, they would fit, you know, with the other things. But they will let me know if they don't. That's why I, when I bought the panel and the, the blocks, I made sure I got plenty in case the top box does not fit with their, what are they called? Their Lego brand and Mega Blocks, that's what they're called. So I made sure I got plenty just in case they did not fit. They had plenty to build with. But yeah, I think they're, I, I think they're really going to like all these. Yes, I'm so, I was so happy to see these. And like I said, they had a pink set with a little girl and a doctor. But my boys are boy boy they're boy boys they uh and the oldest grandson is only 10 so yeah they are like no way are you giving me a girl <laughs> now the draw i don't know why they had a girl and a doctor it made no sense it almost made it sound like girls were always needing a doctor because the doctor was a boy you know so it made no sense why to me but it was like this is not even right but oh well yeah <laughs> but I think these little guys would fit perfect in these storage boxes and these are party favors they are party favors so but they are really really neat and cute for this particular thing. Now, they probably will not organize it like that. They will think these are giant Lego blocks and how neat are that? You know, so. <laughs> so, everybody, that is my Dollar Tree shopping share for the week. I hope you've all had a wonderful, wonderful week. And, um, I guess I will talk to you guys later. Yeah. Um, nothing much going on. My sister came back to Missouri this weekend, so I'm going to go and visit her. She's staying with my mom right now. And other than that, it's the same old, same old around here. <laughs> so I hope you all get out there, find some great stuff at the Dollar Tree. Don't forget to subscribe, give a thumbs up, and leave me that comment. You know I love to hear from each and every one of you. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.